Hello everyone. So today we are going to uh, work on a zoom in and zoom out part of the uh, sniper rifle. So using the mouse wheel, I can zoom in and zoom out. So let's see how to do that today. All right. So first, I'll define the input required for the zoom in and zoom out let's go here and let's add an axis mm. mouse wheel or oh, let's call it zoom axis let's use mouse mouse wheel up and mouse mouse wheel down mouse wheel up positive mouse wheel down negative okay right so now let's implement this zoom axis um where should we implement it I don't think we have enabled user input on this console do I have? No, right. So then here in the CS soldier let's implement under shooting let's add zoom axis input action and uh, we need to transfer this call some event in the weapon to facilitate zooming so in the bp car i have bpi car here i'll add the function zoom in this zone and as an input I'll add a float value right um, yeah. now that I think about it if I implement it as an input axis this will be always called even if the value is zero so now let me change this change that Let's delete it and it would be, uh, implement it as an action. So, same function, same key binding, mouse wheel up and oh, yeah, so me and another one. Oh, no, another. Mm. Action so out <coughs> mouse wheel down right now I can use the same set of uh, same so function here <coughs> instead of value i call delta value right and in here um, let's implement zoom in and zoom out let's just test if these functions are working first as expected here so out yeah they are working okay right now i uh, already have this zoom uh, function in the interface so in the bp con 
we can implement it but for the base gun we don't really have any zoom in effect because we don't have a scope so let's directly go here okay so so event so right now here um, yeah. here I am setting the FOV to 30 when I equip the uh, when I aim in the sniper so let me promote this to a variable let's call it FOV and I'll make it 60 by default right. and here we get a delta value let's get the FOV and add whatever the delta value we get and then let's clamp it in between a mean value and max value so this minimum value would be would represent the maximum zoom level so i'll set it as 30 and this one 60 and then set this fov value and uh, with this result then i have to call the character set ov set fov to update the scope value so get character set fov with this value right oh i didn't connect this function right now here instead of these two we can get weapon and call it so as the delta here zoom in uh, if I want to zoom in that means I want to reduce the field of view delta value if I want to zoom out that means I need to increase the delta value increase the field of view value so this should be one this should be minus one if you want you can have a smaller value as well if you need a more smooth transition right how does this Okay. Right, it is working, but I think it's too slow. So what if I make it five? Yeah, that's easier. Okay, so if you want to have a different maximum zoom level and minimum zoom level, you all you have to do is change in this clamp value so see when you have the correct uh, architecture in your system it's very easy to add new functions as you can just see all right so i'm going to stop this episode right here right so thanks for watching as always project files will be available for the download in patron page link would be in the description below and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patron club thanks for watching See you in another episode. Goodbye.